Top Reasons Why Bia Heza Is Successful The Lavish List We've talked about me, Kevin, being among the top dogs on the YouTube investment channel niche. Well, we can't mention me, Kevin, without talking about another heavyweight in the space, Bia Heza. Bia Heza is an investing genius. However, his journey did not start with real estate. It actually started with drop shipping. Remember the hype when average people like Hayden Bowles and Ari Shurjan were making over six figures per month just selling random stuff like cat socks? Well, Beheza definitely caught on at the right time, while being only 19 years old and having a net worth of over $1.8 million. Welcome to The Lavish List, your guide and path into the crazy life of the wealthy. If you're not subscribed, you're missing out. Number eight, he can find value almost anywhere. There are plenty of reasons why a lot of people will never be successful. Now I know how that sounds, and many of you guys may think that this statement is very pretentious. Unfortunately, many people don't realize this truth because success is a mindset and a habit. So even if a millionaire would lose all their money, they could earn it back because they have the success skills and mindset needed to reach their goals. All the way through, you'll have access to an exact roadmap I would personally use to become a millionaire from scratch in the modern age. Piazza has all the skills necessary to find the value he needs to make a profit. I mean, he was able to flip a free stove he found on Craigslist into a car he sold for $5,000. Wow, what a thrill. Honestly, I really had no idea if I'd actually be able to get this whole thing inside of my car on my own, but... Granted, he did do some other work, like put up Christmas lights for some houses and join his friend's moving company to get an extra $2,000, but it all started with that one free stove from Craigslist. If that's not impressive, then I don't know what is. Number seven, he's so young and successful. Now, when I was 19, my net worth was just enough to cover my yearly subscription to PlayStation Plus. Thankfully, my net worth has increased dramatically since then. However, nothing can compare to Baeza's net worth at such a young age. Overall, for the lifetime of this channel, let's see how much we made. Almost 600,000. Now that millennials and Generation Z is finally entering the workforce and getting paid, we're starting to dabble in the investment world. So when we see a young, successful person like Baeza, it really resonates with us and makes us believe that it is possible for us to do the same. And why wouldn't it be? Now that the internet has opened the marketplace to anyone on earth, People like Mr. Beast, David Dobrik, and Jake Paul have all become millionaires with the internet. All these young and successful people just inspire the youth to begin their entrepreneurial journey and by Heza is definitely one of them. Number six, he stays humble. Getting paid millions of dollars a year for your own hard work is something that can be just so beautiful. There's one problem that comes with that, however, and that's the ability to stay humble. A year's salary right here. What I call them, fun coupons. See that? A fun coupon! Since our capitalistic society basically worships money, anyone who achieves a goal of success could seem like a god to many people. However, many people do not resonate with pretentious people and love people who are successful yet still stay humble. Some people can't handle success. I can. <laughs> Baez is definitely one of those people. His honest and bubbly personality, along with his constant memes and jokes, makes him seem so relatable and humble to his audience. The fact that he's a millionaire, but is still willing to keep his hands dirty in order to become successful. He loves giving his viewers practical advice and shows his viewers that he used to work as a clerk in the mall before he became the success story he is today. Number five, he's a social media master. Look, maybe in the beginning, Facebook and Instagram were just regular places where young whippersnappers would go to post about what memes they saw that day. He's wired in. Is he? Yes. About now, you're still wired in. But now social media is no joke and is a seriously profitable business model. Take the Instagram page Dockin, for example. This page just posts funny memes found on the internet and gets millions of views every day for it. This same Instagram page just sold for $85 million. Yes, you heard me correctly. 85 million bucks for a meme account. This is insane. With this knowledge, it becomes ultimately clear that being able to navigate the social media world is now a legitimate business. Baeza is the master at marketing on social media for Generation Z. He has started multiple drop shipping stores on Instagram, Facebook, and even TikTok. In this video, we're gonna see if it's possible to start up an AliExpress dropshipping business and market it solely using influencers on the TikTok app. Not only can he create drop shipping stores, but he's more than four Instagram pages, each with over 500,000 followers which allows them to have sponsorships that pay them thousands to promote their businesses on their pages. Baeza's grasp on the social media market is one that allows them to have multiple streams of income, something that every person aspires to have. Number four, he loves helping his viewers. 
Even though everyone wants to become successful, when you achieve it, there comes with it a certain emptiness inside. At some point, the money that you make doesn't even matter, and all you want to do is find what would make you happy. That's why one of the most important things about success is not your own success, it's about growing other people around you. Take Ty Lopez, for example. Here in my garage, just bought this uh, new Lamborghini here. It's fun to drive up here in the Hollywood Hills. Because he became the annoying advertising guy that we all know and love. He lived in a trailer park with his mother. One day he called the CEO of a small ad agency who put their ads in the back of the phone book. Ty went to him and said, if you teach me what you know, I will work for you for free. Surprisingly, the CEO took him under his wing and allowed him to learn the ropes of selling and finance. There's usually this urge in successful people to help others grow with them. And you can see that desire in Baeza's content. He's very open and transparent in how he grows his Instagram pages, brokerage accounts, and even how much he makes from YouTube. Overall, for the lifetime of this channel, let's see how much we made. Almost 600,000. All of this content shows that he truly wants to help and inspire his viewers so that they could live the life that he's living. Number three, he tries many different ventures. The average millionaire has at least seven sources of income. With that knowledge, it would be crazy to think that you would get rich simply from working a nine to five job, unless you're a top Facebook software engineer like the tech lead. Having multiple streams of income exponentially grows the amount of money you can generate, which is the whole point of this channel, of course. Baeza is a man of many skills. I can tell you I don't have money, but what I do have are a very particular set of skills. And these skills don't just stop at social media. Baeza has great video series in which he shows his audience his trading skills and portfolio. He even tries crazy side hustles like drop servicing, buying his first rental property, and even making money through PayPal. You can tell that Baeza is someone who actually enjoys trying these side hustles and streams of income, which is a big reason why he's so successful. And like Gary Vee says, when you love what you do, the money doesn't matter. Number two, he's very open. One thing that will never change with people is the fact that they are nosy. We love to focus on other people's lives so that we can escape the boredom of our own. Patrick, she has lost it. She's completely institutionalized. She's forgotten what it's like to live on the outside, to not be in prison. That is why people really appreciate openness and honesty. And like Alex Becker says after Graham Stephen came on the scene, it ruined the game for salesy marketeers trying to make money off of people. Business advice, guys. Yes, Graham Stephen is the number one most acceptable, reasonable, reasonable business advice guy. You By has in his openness with his audience is what really helped him grow so quickly. So many people love seeing successful people's daily lives. So that once they see that someone they engage with on a regular basis lives this life, they're much more inclined to watch so that they can live through them. Number one, he's not afraid to put in work. You can have all the dreams about success you want. If you don't put in the work to become successful, you have no chance. The real hustlers are the people who will go against all odds towards their goals and don't care about what people have to say about it. You can become successful in any field, no matter what anyone tells you. Take Glenn Fidel, a millionaire who made his fortune fixing roofs. That's right, fixing roofs. It work, buddy. <laughs> My name's Glenn Fidel. I'm a professional roofer with tons of business, and that's why I'm on top of the world. That doesn't prove to you you can make money anywhere, then nothing will. Baez is not afraid to put in the work to become successful. He's willing to try anything to get the bag, even if that means driving four hours for his friend's moving company. Overall, his willingness to get his hands dirty to get that green is something that we all can admire for someone so young. And that just about wraps things up for today. We hope you enjoyed this video. Please give us a like and let us know in the comments exactly what you would do if you were filthy, filthy rich. We'd love to hear from you, so tell us. Remember to smash that subscribe button and share this video if you want more ultra luxury videos just like this one. This has been The Lavish List. You stay classy, YouTube.